Hi, I'm Josh Goffer, and this is... Megan Goffer. And we've been a part of Good Shepherd for four years now. So four years ago, Josh and I got married, and we moved to a house in Naperville, and we came to Good Shepherd Church, and about our second time that we were here, Janice Rubin came up to us and said, I don't know if I've seen you guys before. You look like a great, you know, new young couple. And she invited us to come to the very first brainstorming session of 2030. So we were able to get involved in that and it kind of hooked us right from the beginning. And then from there, we were offered kind of the idea of getting involved in Ignite. I felt like we really benefited from kind of the groups we were involved in, the 2030 group, and then being around the high school students all the time. We felt like we were getting so much out of being involved that at some point we owed it to the church to become members and, and be a part of the church. I'm sure a lot of people our age can relate to how easy it is to find things to spend your money on. You know, we have social lives that pull us out on the weekends and we don't have a lot holding us back from shopping or spending. And so we took the time to stop and reflect and realize we need to balance in our life and we needed to think about our priorities and then focus our money in that direction. Megan and I both grew up in the church and we knew tithing was an important part of our, our faith and our religion. But we noticed that over time we started to get kind of lackadaisical about our giving. We would um, reach in our pockets and see how much money we happened to have left over from the weekend or did, did you bring the check? Did I bring the check? So when the offering basket came around, we were never intentional about what we gave. We always felt like we wanted to give something, but we didn't have the discussion ahead of time. When the Beyond series came around, um, it was something that we focused on and wanted to be intentional about. We actually committed to do the um, electronic online giving, and so we're able to intentionally give the amount that we budgeted and still feel good about making sure that um, we deliver it on Sundays. Good Shepherd has so many opportunities to live on mission. Josh and I had the opportunity to go together to work camp this summer with the high school ministry. And in the past, I had the opportunity to go to Guatemala. Not only is there the ability to dedicate and serve on the weekends, but our church provides us the opportunity to go beyond the walls of this church. and experience, do, see life outside, see how God is working in the lives of others who may have a very different lifestyle than we do. So as we look to the future, welcoming our first child into the world um, in these next few months, we are ecstatic to be able to bring a child into this church. And these relationships that we've started and created here um, are so strong and to be able to introduce somebody to the people we've met here is wonderful.